Let's have a look at soft selection here in Cinema 4D. So selecting polygons with soft selection allows you to move them with a smooth interpolation between themselves and the unselected polygons. You can increase the radius value to affect a greater number of polygons, and soft selected elements can be edited using the Move, Scale, or Rotate tools. So let's see what that looks like. I'm going to put a sphere in the scene. Make it a little larger. I'm going to make it editable. And then I'm going to grab my rectangular selection tool. I'm going to middle mouse click. And in the front view, I'm going to make a selection of this first half of these polygons. If I was to pull this up now, I'm going to get something like that. So it's just stretching the polygons. If I undo that by hitting Control Z or Command Z on a Mac. If I come over to the soft selection and enable that, you're going to immediately see that I'm getting a preview of where my soft selection is going to be applied. So the more I increase the radius, the more yellow I'm getting here. That means the more effect it's having. So if I pull this back and then lift up now, get something like that. Step back, pull the radius way up, and get something like that. So depending on what you're trying to do, you could just play around with this and get a bunch of different effects. There's your egg. Back out of that. Plus you have all these different falloffs that you can use that are already set up for you. So these are going to be different falloffs on your polygons. Get dome. Enable is going to turn it on or off. Preview is going to turn off the preview of the yellow which you really need that to understand what's going on. The mode defines where the radius starts, group, center, or all. And remember, it's not just moving. You can scale these, and you can rotate to get some interesting effects. So play around with the soft selection. You can get results with that that would be very hard to achieve any other way.